Now to some dramatic new surveillance video showing the moment an SUV slammed into a south side bus shelter and killed a woman nearby. That video is now part of an ongoing police investigation. Here's CBS 2's Dana Kozlov. Chicago police said the driver of this mangled SUV was speeding when it hit a car and then 67 year old Janice Gilmore before bringing down a traffic light and bus shelter. But on security video from a business nearby, you can see it. Following the bus towards the left of your screen, the SUV is traveling so fast it's a blur before it slams into the sedan. From another angle, you see the bus shelter collapse. I pretty much heard it and then seen the um, aftermath. Jared Brown tried to help Gilmore along with his boss. We tried to talk to her until the paramedics came, but no response. Witnesses say Gilmore was crossing Stony Island when the SUV hit her. Four people were under that bus shelter when it fell, including Tiffany Carter and her young daughter, Takaya. Carter ran, then went back to get Takaya in red, who was under the debris. Both only suffered bruises, the other two also unhurt, along with the SUV's driver. Brown says the driver went over to Gilmore and tried to talk to her. I looked up and I saw him and he was pretty much saying like he was um, like it was something I don't like he didn't know what happened pretty much. The SUV's driver was cited for failure to reduce speed and not having insurance. Witnesses tell us they believe he's from out of state and he was driving a rental car. Police indicate more charges could be coming. Live in the control room, Dana Kozlov, CBS 2 News. Rob. What a terrible tragedy. Yeah. Thanks, Dana.